Hey there, today I will be showing you how to make GIMP look like Photoshop. So to do this we will be using a patch called PhotoGIMP which is provided by Dio Linux and this link will be given in the description below. So first we need to install GIMP and to do this we will have to install Flatpak. So we can begin by going to the Flatpak setup website and you can select the distribution you are on so I am on Ubuntu and we need to follow these simple steps to install it on our system so first we need to enter in the sudo apt Flatpak command And once that is installed, we can type in the second command, which is installing the Flatpak software plugin. And the last command we need to enter is so that we can install things from our terminal. So basically, this will let us install applications from Flatpak via the terminal. We can install GIMP. So copy the command that Dio Linux has provided us on the repository. Proceed with these changes to the system installation. Hit Y on your keyboard. And once the installation is complete, we can download the zip file from the releases page for PhotoGimp. So click on the hyperlink and click on the zip file and save it. I will save it in my downloads folder. And once it is done installing, we can extract the zip file. Simply drag it out. Once it has extracted, you can delete the zip file. And if you open up the folder, you will see that there are three folders. If you do not see these folders, you can hit Ctrl H on your keyboard and that will reveal the hidden folders. We need to move each of the files inside of these folders into the home directory. So as you can see, this icons folder has this photogimp.png. So we need to copy this and go into the home folder. And in here, we need to copy it into the dot icons folder. If you do not see this, once again, hit Ctrl H on your keyboard to show the hidden folders. And if you do not have a dot icons file, you can simply create a new folder and put a dot in front of it and type in icons. So I will go into icons and paste in the photogimp.png. So we have to do this for all of the folders. So now let's do our local. Let's copy this dot desktop file go into home go into the local folder and if you do not have one you can create a new folder name it dot local share applications and simply paste it in here Now lastly, we need to do it for the .var folder, app, and we need to copy this whole folder, go into home, and look for the .var folder. If you do not have one, you can create a new folder, call it .var. Go into app 
and as you can see it says folder is empty so we just paste the folder we just copied and that is it so if I open up GIMP on my other monitor I can see a splash screen of the photo GIMP application which I will show you now so when you open up GIMP it will have a splash screen which looks like this and now I can show you the actual GIMP application so you can see that it already looks pretty close to Photoshop and what we need to do is we need to make these icons smaller as Photoshop has really small icons compared to this so what we need to do is go into edit preferences and under icon you can click on this guess icon size from resolution and click on custom icon size and make sure it is on small and as you can see all the icons are smaller now click on OK to save it open up a new file and if you want to remove this ruler you can go into view and untick show rulers and as you can see this is really close to Photoshop have fun designing thank you for watching